Many are predicting that the worst is yet to come, which is unfortunate, said one person here. Until now, they've enjoyed the reputation of being the nation's icebox. Watched a burglar in his home this morning by webcam. As a journalist of over 25 years, stories are what make my world turn. Reporting live from the Dallas Newsroom tonight, Jeff Curley, Fox 4 News. But in 2008, I took the jump from my familiar life and started a PR firm from my home. We're talking about anyone with a camcorder like the one I'm using becomes a television network. We started slowly growing the company and we now have over a hundred clients and we've branched into the world of live digital broadcasting. I now own eight different TV studios and have a huge team. And the stories that I now get to share are sometimes the most important of my life. Life has a funny way of coming around full circle. This is The Jeff Crilly Show. Welcome to my show. You know I love, love to feature companies that are doing outstanding things in the community and have great brands. And I can't think of a better brand to bring on the show right now than uh, Republic Title of Texas and Sherry Groom. Thank you for coming on the show. You're welcome. Thanks for having me. Well, you have I'm such <laughs> well, you have such a great uh, brand. Everybody knows Republic Title of Texas. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Tell us the history. Well, we I was um, thinking about it last night. Next year, we will be 30 years old. I've been with the company probably 25 of those 30 years. Wow. And since that time, we've grown to over 400 employees. Um, we're the largest title company in Texas. Congratulations. Thank you. And um, it's just, it's got a great, um, it's got a great story. It's a great company. And one of the things I love is that although you've grown, it's still very much mm -hmm. a small company mm -hmm. where, you know, everybody has each other's back and, and uh, knows, you know, their the wife, husband, kid's yes. name. Yes. You know, um, we still send out birthday, birthday cards to all our employees. Um, we put money in them. It's just, um, there's a lot of things that we do that really make it feel like a family. And a lot of that's intentional. I mean, we have a, uh, a group, a board of people um, from employees to HR directors that sit on it that plan things for, for us to do inside the company and outside the company. So we, we take pride in that. And all the employees do. They love it. It's that's, awesome. That's wonderful. Yeah. Well, I have to ask you about the pandemic because, mm -hmm. you know, it, it stopped everyone in their tracks. But mm -hmm. if, if you're in the middle of a closing or you're about to close, I'm, how did you guys deal with that? Yeah. You know, um, I had one of our agents call me and just say, Sherry, what are you going to do if everything shuts down? And believe it or not, um, I really didn't think we were going to get to that point. You know, um, so I was like, business will go on as usual. If for some reason we have to shut down an office, we'll alternate. Um, but since we were deemed essential from the very beginning, um, there really wasn't a stop for us. So we just kept going, but we just modified the way we did it. We did it from, um, sent a lot of people home for safety of employees and our guests. Right. Um, did a lot of closings outside the office, be it outside on a table, underneath a you know, an awning. We did it where the people sat in their car and we brought the papers to them. Um, we did a lot of remote um, notaries where people were in their homes and we were behind a computer screen. We did a lot of that. So we just hit the ground running and thought, what can we do? Because it's going to, business is going on and our customers depend on this. I mean, yes. Um, and we, we did well. We and, did yeah, well. That's so important because, you know, uh, the, the home is the biggest purchase mm -hmm. anyone ever makes. And yeah. I'm sure there's some anxiety around that. And for uh, a company like yours to be able to hold their hand through that difficult time, that's, that's really well, yeah, impressive. Well, yeah, we didn't want to add another layer to something that they would be nervous about. You know, yes. you're already spending. It's a lot of money that you're spending. It's a move for your family across town. And then to all of a sudden go, well, it might not happen because the company might close. Or right. um, they might not be able to record your documents. So we just tried to think of what every step beyond that was going to look like so that we could provide the ease and comfort for the customers. And um, I think we all, and you know, all the title companies, I have to say, I think they all did really well. Um, I've right. got a lot of friends in different areas and we all talked and kept up to date and tried to help each other because we want to help the, the community. To be honest, I mean, we do. That's really cool. And yeah. I, I know uh, one of your customers, in, in, in a way, or partners, are realtors. And, mm -hmm. and so you're always giving great information to realtors. We, have, we found a clip off of your website. Let's roll yes, that right now. Absolutely.
That's awesome. And I love it that you do that because it, it becomes a, a resource for realtors and yes. they, they in turn can show that to their customers mm -hmm. to reassure them that, you know, this is a great market. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of things on there that they can kind of take for themselves brand and send out to their customers who are coming in from out of state um, that might not know the area. We have a lot of school information on there, a lot of tax rates. It's really meant to be a resource for them so they don't have to go recreate that. So it's there for them to use in their business. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, let's talk about the market because because I think Dallas-Fort Worth is one of the most magical communities mm -hmm. in the country. Uh, we're so diverse. We have so many different, uh, uh, you know, even when oil and gas may not be robust, right. we have other industry to pick us up. Uh, what's your forecast for, for how the uh, housing market's going to go in the next uh, months or years? You know, um, really, I, it's really trending that for the next several years, due to the fact that this interest rates are so low, that we're going to do well. Our we are actually um, running about the same as last year or even ahead of last year as far as volume wow. that we have, which is crazy to me. But a lot of that was spurred by refinances. So we do, sure. you know, a lot of people do construction on their homes because the rates are so low. Um, so that's great. You know, I do think, too, a lot of businesses may move here from other parts um, of the world, basically because it's easier to do business here. And so yes. I think with everybody moving here, I don't foresee anything for the next several years that's going to stop us from moving forward. And oh. that's great. I mean, yes. it's great for all of us and just, you know, the DFW areas, you know, for as a whole. That's cool. And then to be doing it alongside people that you know and love mm -hmm. uh, in the workplace is so important. Mm -hmm. We've got some pictures that we pulled off of Facebook. I want you to describe some of the uh, the pictures that we're seeing here. Yes. So um, we ha every Halloween we have a dress up contest where our employees, our executives dress up and then we give out prizes for the best um, the best. Sometimes they'll do it as a group. Sometimes they'll do it individually. This one was... <laughs> That's so cool. <laughs> it was a group. Um, and there's another one that was a, like a last year. Um, one There's one of our executives, David Kramer. And then <laughs> I won't disclose who's in the, no, the no. Uh, monkey costume. <laughs> and this was probably at our company event that we have every year we get together. Or no, this was at one of our offices um, appreciation parties, oh, customer cool. appreciation parties that we had last year. Um, Christmas. And there's an ugly sweater contest. <laughs> okay, we okay. That every year, and that's been a fan favorite. We thought that might fall away, but it just continues to be. Um, that was all of our sales team. Mardi Gras. Uh, yes. That's awesome. Yes. What they, a fun company. Um, they love it. You know, we have um, for like the last six years, I believe, mm -hmm. um, been one of the top places to work with Dallas Business Journal. Wow. And um, that's a real credit to, I mean, I have to say it, I don't want to sound cliche, but a real credit to our employees, to our people. Yes. Um, you know, people come to work for us. We empower them to move within the company as they grow. If they want to learn other things and there's openings, we offer that. Um, so they come and they stay. We don't have a huge attrition rate. And that's rare in our industry, yes. I'll say. And that gives us a great edge because we have so much knowledge um, in, in all of our branches and our commercial arenas at our corporate office. Um, and so I think that's a that makes people feel good too. And and it's, it speaks volumes that, that you've been there for twenty five mm -hmm. years. That's amazing. Nobody yes. nobody stays that long with any company. Oh anymore, no, so. I I love this company. I'm very passionate about it. Um, it's great to begin with, so there's not a whole lot. But I um, I love being able to improve it and listen yeah. to the employees, see what they want to do to improve it, and just leave it a little better that's than, awesome. than I found it. So, well, that's, that's my plan. <laughs> <laughs> that's wonderful. Well, that, that's a good note to leave our interview on. We're going to put your website up so people can yes. uh, contact you. RepublicTitle.com is the website. Uh, Sherry Groom, thank you so much for coming You're on the welcome. show. You're welcome. Thank you for having me. Yeah. I appreciate it. You bet. And that's it for now. We'll see you next time.